Hey guys, my name is Prince and welcome to another video. In this video, we'll be discussing how gas fuel works on the OpenSea marketplace. I got um, some questions on the previous video I made about setting up your first NFT using OpenSea and MetaMask. And if you are new to NFT, you can check the video as I'll be adding it on the card above. So the two questions I got were from Sarah and um, Matthias where they asked about gas fee and how it works and if you are required to pay gas fee on every NFT you upload to the marketplace. To get answer to the questions, I'll have to run you through the different sell method that's available on the marketplace. So the OpenSea marketplace has three different sell method. The set price where you set a fixed price for your NFT. The highest bid whereby you put the NFT for auction where the buyer with the highest bid gets the item. Then the group or what we call the bundle is you put in two to three different NFTs together to sell them as a group or a bundle which you can add as much as possible as you want. So gas fee applies to the first two methods first item you put up for sale using set price you pay gas fee for it then first item you put up for sale using highest bid you pay gas fee for it then every other item you put up for sale using any of the two after you've paid the initial gas fee which is like an entry fee for the two is free so you get to pay gas fee once for set price get to pay gas fee once for highest bid then after that every other item you put up into the marketplace is free of charge so for the bundle part, the bundle comes to play when you already have items in the marketplace. Say you have about five or six items already in the marketplace and you want to group three of those items and sell them as a bundle. Put those three items together. So let me show you. Let's say I hit the bundle tab for example and I select this two and I sell as a bundle. Because I already have items on the marketplace, when I put a name for my bundle and I put an amount for it, once I post this listing, I am not charged for this because I already have items at the marketplace. So the only instances where you are supposed to pay gas fee are when you are putting up your first item as a set price and your first item as an auction after which every other item is free of charge. So that answers the question for the gas fee on the OpenSea marketplace. Then Sarah talked about paying about 112 for her item she put up for listing gas fee on the marketplace flung to it so you can try to put up your first item and use the gas fee is about say the 112 then you try again later and see it has reduced to about let's say 70 75 dollars so this gas fee flung to it and this fluctuation is as a result of the conjection on the ethereum network putting up your first item if you try and you see that the gas fee is expensive for you you can just hold on and try again sometime later and see if it has reduced so that's how the payments work there is no fixed price for the gas fee it's due to the the ethereum network so that's that about the fluctuation in gas fee i think that answers um both questions if you have any other question you want me to attend to please reach me on the comment section and i would get back to you so guys thank you for watching and catch you guys on the next one